Chords A, B, and C, D intersect at E in circle O, as shown in the diagram below. Duh. Secant F, D, A, and tangent F, B are drawn to circle O from external point F. Yeah, all the shit's here. And chord A, C is drawn. None of that shit is necessary. They could have also just marked this for us immediately. D, A is equal to 56, and D, B is 112. But they're dicks, so they didn't. So we have to. The ratio of AC to CB is 3 to 1. Well, maybe AC is 3 degrees and BC is 1 degree. It certainly doesn't look true. Maybe AC is 30 and BC is 10. Maybe it's 6 and 2. 30 is 3 times 10. 10 is 1 times 10. 6 is 3 times 2. 2 is 1 times 2. In fact, 3 times any number over 1 times that same number will always reduce to 3 over 1. So if we let AC equal 3x, then CB would have to be 1x. Again, this reduces to 3 over 1. This trick works with any ratio, so if I gave you a ratio of 4 to 7, you could let the first thing be 4x and the second thing be 7x. Now they want to know CEB. That's this angle over here. Whenever you have an angle formed by the intersection of two chords, it's equal to the average of the intercepted arcs. There's our intersecting chords, and there's the intercepted arcs. So we need to take the average of 56 and x, which means we need to know x. We can solve for x with this equation. The 56, the 112, the x, and the 3x add up to 360 degrees. So 168 plus 4x is equal to 360. So 4x is equal to 192. So x is 48. So the average of 56 and x is the average of 56 and 48, which is 52. Now they want angle F. That's this angle outside. The formula for this outside angle is the big intercepted arc minus the small intercepted arc over 2. The angle intercepts DB and AB. The small arc is 112. The big arc is 3x plus 1x is 4x. We found x was 48, so it's 4 times 48. And that all comes out to 40. Lastly, we've got to find angle DAC. An inscribed angle is equal to half the intercepted arc. Our angle cuts off DC. Recalling X is 48, DC is 112 plus 48. And that all comes out to 80. The links for this are in the description. jmap.org put together all 456 regions questions by topic in a PDF. So you can practice your weak topics. Have fun on the regions. Come see me for tutoring. Don't forget to watch the prank calls.